Hello YouTube! How are you people? It's your boy Kevin Gannitz. Today we're going to have a quite interesting day. I didn't even want to vlog it, but Lena said I should because it's going to be a great video, so I'm just going to go for it. Uh, we are going to Sam's Club without a membership to try to get some chicken salad because apparently Sam's Club has like the best chicken salad ever according to Lena, so... Enjoy the new intro that I have for you guys. This is vlog 80. In case you guys didn't know, every 20 vlogs, I change the intro scene a little bit. So enjoy the new one. <laughs> Sit back, relax. You guys are watching G-Vlog. It's gonna be an interesting day, to say the least. <laughs> I'm guessing right. you're ready? Go ahead. So Lena, why don't you explain to YouTube where we're going today? What's the plan today? We're going to the Universal Studios. No, for real. And we're getting seven turkey legs. That's Disney World. Where are we going to? To To Boston Market. <laughs> Sam's Club. We're gonna try to go in there and get chicken salad without having a membership card. No. Who came up with this idea? Well, obviously me, because it's fun. <laughs> Like, what's the chances of us 50, actually 50. doing 50 50. Yeah. Wow, that's actually high. There's a good lower. chance to go. They might say, Sure, go ahead. I don't need your your five dollars here, just use it. And then, when... here goes nothing. So we made it, finally found it. What do you think, Lena? I'm scared. Why? Because they're not gonna let me in. So then why did we come here? Because I can help them. Okay. Step one is complete. I forgot the last time I was in a Sam's Club or another kind of similar store like this. Body, Jesus, thick lines. So, we made it in somehow, some way. Uh, now, the plan is get the chicken and try to pay for it somehow. Ew. Is that it? I'm not sure. Why don't you hold it or let me hold it and if we can find the real thing. Okay. I wouldn't say $20 is nice, but it's nice. Yes, it is. No. Yay! You know I can't eat bread, right? Lena's trying to get me to eat bread again. If you guys didn't see this episode of the vlog, it shows how Lena sabotages my diet constantly, so not falling for it today. Nope. Not doing it. Alright, let's go. So what do you got there? I got chicken salad and chicken salad. Uh, 
Nah, I'm not gonna do that. Good. No way in the throw. Photo looks nice. <laughs> yeah, what about him? He's like smiling, like, oh, uh -huh. oh. On the way coming here, Lena had like a foolproof plan. Now we're just walking around with the food in our hands and she don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> Shot. All right, I don't know what to do. I'm scared if I pick the wrong guy, then you're gonna say, you, you blew it. <laughs> I say go for it. Push on. Push a kachaga. Thank you. We'll see you, my friend. Thank you. Success. We got the chicken salad and croissants bonus extra. How you feel? Yeah. Leaving Sam's Club now. We got some chicken salad and some croissants. So, mission accomplished. Complete. Welcome to the crazy world of Sam's. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So you're telling me not only did Gajo let us use his card and cut in front of him, he didn't take the five dollars you were gonna give him for letting us use his card? Wow. My friend, you are official vlog number 80 MVP. Didn't even get your name, but thank you. If you ever watch this vlog somehow, some way, no. Never gonna happen. <laughs> I don't even know how we ended up getting this, I'll be honest with you. How was your day? <laughs> I cut it off now. No, you said for me to make a vlog, I'm making a vlog. You can't back out of the vlog now. There's no way. Lena was very, very, very much under pressure just now in Sam's Club. She was like real panic and then she said, I'm just gonna ask one person, and if the one person don't wanna let us use their card, then I'm just gonna walk out. I'm gonna put the chicken salad down, I'm gonna walk out of here. So, thank God the first person, like half said yes, half said no. Pretty sure it was a gentleman and his son, and the son said no, but then the father said, uh, no, no, don't worry, you can use it. Because we wasn't making them pay for it or anything. I guess seen the, the video. other guy who said that I asked, why are you letting them do that? That's what it says. Yeah. Because you gotta understand something. They come here. How much is to have a membership here? $45 a, a month? month. No, not a month. A year. All right. They gave $45 for the year membership, right? Yeah. We didn't give nothing for the membership. Now, we're coming in the store where they signed up, where they had a hard time, and they're putting their hard-earned money to get in the store to use their card. Hello. I'll give you money for yourself if you just let me help me and let me use it. So then I pulled out the five dollars. The guy said, "No, I don't want your money. Uh, come in front of me and you can use my card." So he let me use it. 
And then guess what the jinx son said? Why are you letting her do that? Like real nervous thing. <laughs> Like 30 years old, the father was like 60. God bless him. <laughs> There's don't a... put me on yeah. there. Make a vlog today. Me and you will go get chicken shot. Take me off. I don't want me on there. If there's a lesson to be learned today that we went through just now in the store, have you guys heard the story? Is that there's always going to be someone nice and there's always going to be someone mean standing in your way. Like, a lot of times we do this with customer service. Like, sometimes you'll call up and uh, you'll need something done. You'll need uh, some kind of customer service guy to help you with anything. Could be uh, tech support, could be your phone's not working, could be your phone broke, you're replacing it. And there'll always be one person that says, no, we can't do that. But then you hang up and you remake the same phone call and then you get someone nice on the phone and the nice person will say, yes, no problem. Here's your confirmation number. There's always going to be someone mean in your way. You always just got to keep going until you find a nice person. <coughs> Quote of the day? No, Lena said no. I think so. I think it's nice. Oh, really? They don't have any Coke Zero cherries right now. Got some sodas. I'm going to go home and... Uh, taste this chicken salad and I'm hoping it's great as Lena made it because we went through a tragedy just now to actually get this chicken salad so I'm hoping it's as good as Lena claims I can't imagine going home and tasting this chicken salad that we suffered for <laughs> and then it's just bought I could imagine that so much right now after I put gas we're gonna go home and we're gonna have a taste of this chicken salad so see you guys home just got back home. I'm gonna try out some uh, Sam's Club non-membership edition chicken salad. So this is the moment we've been waiting for. That's all right. We want that. Bone off the feet. Or no, I should start saying the Reddit thing. I should just all right, let's just go for it. Please. Bone yeah. apple tea. Bone apple tea. Mm. It's supposed to be this chewy. Tell me. I mean, it's okay. Grilled chicken, where you hate Okay, Elsa's on your side. It's alright. <laughs> Lena's getting mad. Lena's getting mad. Just took her all the way to Sam's Club. Could've get locked up. Now she's getting mad at me. Wanna draw this? Hold on. That looks like I'm saying Could you stop talking while I record? Yeah. Thank you. This is definitely not diet food, by the way. <coughs> it's a good. I wouldn't like ever go through what we went through just now again. <laughs> For it, I'll be honest. No. It's good. Mm. I give this chicken salad a six point five out of ten. It's good. Don't get me wrong. But my favorite chicken salad I've ever eaten so far in life is still from uh, Casola's. What number vlog was that that we went there? I could draw this, right? In about. Who got Alright. He was all getting dressed to go have ice cream somewhere, get out. Look it. Kevin, please, I'll put you on the vlog. Put one on the vlog. We're screaming and saying somebody got killed. Oh, it's going. Uh, right With my zero reaction to the situation. Yeah. Who got killed? The bag's off. He's off. He's sick, he had to come. Why? What happened? He's nuts. What would cause you to make this assessment? The vacuum on for two, three, like maybe 15 to 20 seconds. Not okay. Get you all the food on the floor. Make your own money. Do what you gotta do because that man is scared. He scares the shit out of me. I'm He's better okay. to say. He's normal that he has the weirdest. I just said serve him food in bed, which I hate to do because if you could walk and if you could talk and you're not sick, I don't think anybody's oh, supposed to eat in bed. Right now. All right, I don't like that. Bring him food in bed. 
right. I just want the vacuum to go wrong because he put cigar juice all over it. Okay. Carolina was out with the kids and I'd be stuck with him out. I'm Why do you like me? He's very impossible. Lena asked you a question. Wait, your mother's name. He's impossible. He's impossible. See, that's the ice. And there's nothing to live for. Like, how's he still alive? The body don't burn. <laughs> You couldn't wait. Now you could clean the whole thing out of the vacuum. You got spaghetti all over now. Right, you clean. Right. Now you stay at home and clean. Okay. Give my credit card. We don't got your credit card. Where is it? It's upstairs. Go get it. That was interesting. Over that? That was funny. Is that like the worst argument you've seen my family have? I just, it's high for me. Like, what makes Nicole think the coffee is causing the argument? Let me see what I'm going to tell you. Who puts spaghetti? Oh, I'm going to tell you. Let me see what I'm going to tell you. Let me see what I'm going to tell you. A few moments later. So after our little chicken salad adventure, we chilled at home. Wasn't really much else to do. Today was a day off from work for me. So just did the whole Saturday home. Uh, then my uncles called me and my cousins and they said they're going to watch the Conor McGregor versus Cowboy fight, I believe is the two names of the individuals fighting tonight. So that's what we're going to be doing. So just got dressed. It's a little early, so I'm gonna wait till it hits about 8, 8.30, and then we're gonna meet up all of us at Ale House to go watch the fight. So, I'll see you guys there. All right, so ignore Parry for tonight. You know where we're gonna be if we don't do it? Uh, I'll beat you. I don't know where we're gonna be at. Oh, I'm sniper. I can shave it. I'm at the cage with it. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Jesus. I'm happy. Oh, my God. I thought you said you could really start having stuff. We're gonna change it. Well, if you got the Apple, give me the food. I got the iPad. I bought the people that's buying the bathrooms. See a little separation. I'll go there. What? Predictions for tonight. Go ahead. Uh, Cowboy's gonna kick Conor McGregor's ass. You think so? I know so. Parry, prediction. <laughs> Parry, prediction for tonight. Who's winning? Venom dies in the next movie. <laughs> 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 Nothing to do with it. Oh, you got it. I didn't even know who we are. So Uncle Ricky tried to order spinach dip. And they brought nachos instead. Is that what happened? Yes. yes. These are like the best nachos I've ever ate in my life. No, they're not. My life. This is dry. You're dry. The chicken's dry. You're serious. What's your prediction tonight, Dave, for the fight? Cowboy. Cowboy? Why? I never seen him fight before. I'm a fan of Conor McGregor, but he always fails. Is that true? <laughs> Predictions for tonight. Conor McGregor. How many rounds is it? I don't know. Fourth round knockout. What's your prediction for tonight? Cowboy, bound chick, commission. I'm a major fourth round knockout. Jeremiah's my religion. Will he go down? I have no straight telephone. You cannot bend what is not straight. Here we go. He's about to go right to the table. Watch the watch. Right to the table. Right to the table. Right to the table. The watch is distracting. Talking about. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
So, gotta wait for these Indyna Gajana fights. And then after that, I think it's the Conor McGregor fight. So, looking forward to it. I'm all for the equal rights thing, but I can't watch two women fight right now on the TV for three hours. Like, and then Ross, they can't go like this, but yeah! Not Is that why you're outside? Do that dance. Come on. Do that dance. That's not the dance you was doing, but that's still a good dance, though. I gotta give it to you. Rocking those killer kicks. Do the dance. Do the dance your father showed you. Oh, you do that. Yeah, you do it. <laughs> Finally got the Conor McGregor versus Cowboy fight coming up. Any last minute predictions? No. Second round or roundhouse. All early predictions are finalized. Somebody's gonna win, somebody's gonna win. Knockout. Jeremiah, my husband. I honestly don't care who wins, I'll be honest. Why is it pissed off? Why is it pissed off? I got for the low table, right? $197. $200. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to you. Yeah, I'm Dave, are you happy? I'm happy. You're happy? Good night, Uncle David. Uncle David, are you happy with the result? He got his ass whipped. What was that? I called it. Here, Dave. I got the bag. I'm jumping you. Good night, yo. I'm saying that was the shittest fight I ever watched. No, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm the other fights that I had, Matty O'Ryan. I would have been mad, but the fight I <laughs> wanted was good. Oh, my God. I wanted to uh, make a fight. I'm saying that was the shittest fight. The biggest shit I ever seen in my life. I'm happy I didn't pull Uncle David and come here at 6 o'clock. Could you imagine that waiting one. all day to see that 40 second fight? Well, we did. You know what that was? Super Smash Brothers. Same thing. As soon as someone starts, you just destroy them. Amazing. The Amazing. Daddy. Thank you guys for watching. Give the video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next episode of G Vlog. I'm Kevin Gannett. That's JoJo Rickies. And that's Diva D. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. You win, Kevin.